my sweet friends welcome back as you see i'm in the car i'm getting ready to head out and do some errands so the first place that i wanted to go is stop in at walmart check out their spring line as well as just pick up some valentine's day treats and candies and desserts to replenish those that i decorated with in my valentine's day decorate with me they were a big hit and are long gone also i made an online target order this morning if you remember i mentioned that we were doing a mini makeover in our master bedroom where we're doing some painting so i wanted to refresh our space with some new bedding so definitely stick around to the end you'll get a sneak peek of that along with any of the items that i pick up today at wall Walmart. So I hope that you enjoy hanging out with me. If you are new, my name is Amy and welcome. I hope you enjoy it here. Be sure to give me a big thumbs up and if you haven't already, maybe consider subscribing. I would love to have you back. All right, friends. Well, let's go ahead. Head out. I hope you enjoy. Up first at Walmart, let's check out the Pioneer Woman line. To me, it screams spring with all of its vibrant colors. Here is a beautiful large mixing bowl priced at $19.97, which is kind of a weird price to me, don't you think? But anyway, just look at all of the gorgeous details, and you're going to see this in all of the pieces throughout her collection. five-piece crock set would definitely make a statement right next to your stove. It says Lazy Susan, so I guess the crock actually spins. That is pretty unique, plus you get your four utensils. Next up is a colander set. Both are plastic. The large one has that beautiful flower pattern in blue, and then the smaller coral one has a coordinating pattern. There's tons of matching items, a mini crock, a grease strainer, a glass juicer, a gourmet cruet, and prep bowls, along with all the coordinating utensils to really make a beautiful matching set. Also, fairly new to Walmart is the My Texas House collection created by Erin. She began her career on Instagram, first with her beautiful area rugs, and now she has branched into a whole house collection ranging from bedding, pillows, curtains and furniture, even bathroom items, and here we're seeing several of her hand towel sets. Now, you can definitely shop her collections easily online as many stores don't even carry her items yet. But I thought this tea towel set was absolutely beautiful with that embroidery. And I just love how all the tea towels coordinate but don't match exactly. As we browse here, you'll see that she has a two-piece set, a three-piece set, a four-piece set, and then she has a huge set coming here later that includes pot holders and the whole kind of combo that you would need for your kitchen, aprons, tea towels, and everything. This would also be great to put in like a gift bag if you have a new neighbor or something like that. So all these items I think are great in color and quality. Next, I wanted to share with you a few of Walmart's new spring throw rugs for your kitchen or entryways.
this is one of my favorites. I love the pattern and also that fringing at the end. It comes in the four colors. I'll lay it out here so you can see just that beautiful pattern. And again, just the quality for only $15.97. I think this is a winner. Now let's check out this section, which has lots of new spring finds. I love this wall art piece. It has a great looking frame and would be a great focal point alone or even in a gallery wall. This next wall art piece is a 16 by 12 and has a grouping of really spring flowers to brighten up any wall. Now next is a wood hexagon medallion. Again, this would look great in a gallery wall or even group two or three together in a line vertically to dress up a narrow wall space. Tucked here in the back is a small trivet. I love the detail of the wheat on that. That would look great next to a bedside table or next to your kitchen sink to catch jewelry. They have a few little tabletop signs. Our family is blessed. And then they have a stack of faux books, Fill Life with Love. That could even be used now during Valentine's Day. Here is a sculptural piece, very modern looking. You could also even stack your rings on the fingers. Here on the bottom shelf, they have a fairly large 18 by 22 wall art piece, a comfy poof that you can sit back and kick your feet up. These are great for adding extra seating. And then look here to the left, there is a coordinating pillow. It's a lumbar style, but that is a great pillow here at Walmart. Love the tassels, it does have a plain back. Here is a few more wall decor pieces, perfect for spring. I'll do my best to zoom in on the price. We have some mirrors as well as clocks in this area as well, but I think all of these are great quality for the price point. This round gold mirror at just under 15 would look great in a bathroom or even on a vanity. I thought it looked very high end and for that price point, a great find here at Walmart. Here's another cute little sign. I thought that was a little pricey for that. Love lives here. This arrangement would be nice if you are wanting to just pick up something quickly to pop on a shelf or even on a tabletop surface. Now they also had some of these tumblers mixed in. It's 30 ounces. I did like the top that it had the wood, but I couldn't find a price on it. Love brings you home. Perfect again if you're going for a more neutral look here at Valentine's Day, but absolutely could be used throughout the year. Next is a scented candle for eight. It is a gardenia scent, and I think they have three other candles, which we'll see a little bit later. Here's another wall art piece. When you focus on the good, the good gets better, like that saying, for only, I think it was $9.98. Here is another prearranged arrangement in a wooden box. Again, a little pricey at that point. I think you could probably go ahead and DIY that yourself. These are really nice. It's a three piece tabletop candle holder set. I think these are nice quality and for three at $24.95, I think that's great. Next is a mini sign in a world where you can be anything, be kind. And then finishing up this aisle is two amber glass prearranged flower sets at $12.68 and then this one at $12.88. And I have to be honest, that last one was not for me. <laughs> Next up is a gorgeous lamp. I love the texture in the base of that and then the lampshade. Very nice. These would be great to place in an area where you do not have a plug and you could use a magic light bulb. Here is a set of three shelves for $15.17. And here is again another candle. This one is cypress and rosemary. 
Up next is a sign or kitchen. If I had to stir it, it's homemade. I like that. Kind of funny. <laughs> but I like that wooden frame on it at $14.77. Not sure if this was what was $5.98 or if it is the Love Lives Here. Remember, we seen that earlier and I thought that was overpriced. So maybe it six dollars it's better here is a very spring little plaque and then up next for $9.97 is a three-piece candle holder set I love the colors on these they are very in trend right now for the color palette that we're seeing in both the hearth and hand and studio McGee lines here is one of those flip signs we've seen these at Hobby Lobby as well as Target this one I think is really nice it has a lot of detail and here's the final color that they have in that single wick candle. It's Honey Bell and Cream Scent. Here is a little plate. It's trimmed in gold. Think happy, be happy for just under $5. Here's a pretty nice looking tray for $18.90. Eight. I love the detail of the handles. The wood itself isn't the best for that price. I think it should be real wood instead of that fake MDF. So you could definitely do better at Home Goods. Here's a couple more little plates looking good, as well as this little trivet. It did have like a green background with just that weaving on top for $9.88. Finishing up this section, we have this beautiful wall art piece. It's fairly large and priced at $24.98. I think this is something very comparable to what you could find at Hobby Lobby. I love the color and pattern of this throw rug for only $9.97. I think this would look great, of course, as an accent rug, but also layered under a doormat like the one right next to it, which says our nest. I think that would be perfect for spring. Here is a lantern. I really like that rope handle and it does kind of have a plasticky feel. So I'm not sure if that's meant to be for the outdoors. It is pretty pricey at $27.97. Then they had some really large Euro pillows, really nice quality. And then I was really surprised with this pillow. It had a lot of detail has lots of like embroidery on there and I just think this would be perfect on a front porch for the springtime probably in a covered area up next is a belly basket priced at just under 30 but I like that it can be displayed two ways like it is collapsed over there and then here with the fabric up and I do like the faux leather handles I think it really looks high-end now let's move back into the garden section and take a look at their new spring items. They have lots of plant stands and I think these are gorgeous as plant stands, but they can also be used for risers for decor. So let's go ahead and take a look at all of these. I'll try to show you the picture on the front of the packaging so you can kind of get a better look at how they will look once they're assembled. Next up is a rolling cast iron plant stand. Now I love this piece. I love that you can just turn and rotate your plants so that you can get sun all the way around it. And it's priced at $15.88. So I think that's a great deal. Coming up here, you have some of those propagation stations. Now we see these lots in hearth and hand. So if you love to propagate plants, those would be perfect. Now, I have seen tons and tons of terrariums. They have a few in Hobby Lobby. And here are just things that you can pop in your terrarium. Here's a terrarium kit for $7.84. And then here is a package of garden moss for just under $4. I think that's a pretty good price for that. And then, wow, here is Walmart's Great Wall of Planters. They seem to have every size, texture, color available to man. And really, you can use these planters as vases inside your home now and then use them for outdoor planting once we get to that season. Now, I chose a few of these to bring home with me, so stick tight and be sure to check out the haul at the end to see which ones I'll be using in my home right now and until that time.
as you are seeing, they have tons and tons of texture, which really adds a lot of interest to your space. This one right here really caught my eye. I love that it looks like a basket. It's under $30, but it's made out of a material that I think would weather really nicely. Here's some smaller pots that add just a summer or spring flair to your space. They also have these that I think are gorgeous as a set, a small, medium, and large, and then just lots of different options and colors to choose from. Now, if you enjoy more spring color, this section will make your heart happy. Up next is many of their woven planters. Many of those have stands and I think they just are gorgeous. All of them are under 30. This item people are raving about on TikTok and Instagram, and I can see why. They're small little aged saucers that go under planters, but you could definitely use these in different areas. You could use them beside a sink for your soaps. You could use them in your bathroom to contain like your makeups. So I could see a lot of different options for these little trays and the price is spectacular. They have the pots that go along with it. And so they also have your basic terracotta right underneath, but these are already aged and beautiful. And at that price, I think that's great. The Home Edit is another Instagram famous company that has brought its products now to Walmart. They are two ladies whose skills for organizing are amazing and they use lots of organizers like these. Here are a few of the products that they have in store in my stores for all of your organizing needs. I love personally the clear bins because you can actually see what's inside and they definitely have other options like bamboo that will organize all of your clutter and really get everything nice and tidy. And you can use these in many areas of your home. All these individual sets come in at under 20, which is a really great price for an organized clutter-free home. Last but not least, I wanted to share with you all the kitchen products displayed in our Walmart for the beautiful line by Drew Barrymore. They have tons of kitchen appliances and essentials like coffee makers, air fryers, mixers, electric griddles, crock pots, nonstick cookware sets, utensil holders, hand blenders, juicers, microwaves, all both in gray and the white color. All right, so now that we're back home, I wanted to share with you a haul of the things that I got at Walmart, as well as a sneak peek of the bedding. So first off, just if you're wondering, I wanted to share the different candies that I did pick up for Valentine's Day to refill our containers. So the first one, which I thought was going to be super yummy, is Lava Cake Kisses. Those sound yummy. So it looks like it has like a soft chocolatey center. And then for something a little bit sour, so we got sweet and we need some sour, is these Jolly Ranchers. And they come in cherry, strawberry, and watermelon. So I think that will be great. And then to fill up my hearth and hand cake stand, 
I picked it up some of these frosted sugar cookies. All right, so let's go ahead and now start with some of the decor pieces that I picked up from Walmart. Since they had a lot of their planters out, I really thought that they were beautiful and would look great inside now before all the plants and things go outside. So I thought this one was gorgeous. This was just under, I think, $4. I love the texture in that. It just like kind of sparkles in the light and kind of just brings a lot of texture and attention. So I think that is really pretty. And also I picked up a couple of these. These are these faux boxwood orbs. I went ahead and picked up a few. You could use these on candlesticks as well as just even take that pot and pop that inside for a cute little topiary. And so I believe this was just under $4 as well, but doesn't that even look really cute? I picked up this one. I think this is really pretty. I could see this even styled as just a decorative piece on an entryway table. I think that is really pretty. And then if you've seen some of the high end containers that have moss, I think this would lo really look pretty with that. All I would do, I think, is just put in maybe some crunched up notebook paper or even old Christmas paper inside and then pick up some moss. This is also at Walmart, but I picked some of this up and kind of just lay that on top and you'll get that high end look for really, really cheap. So I think this was $4 and then this pot itself was I think just under 11, but I just love that texture and it really looks like a high end piece and only $11. So I think that's a great find. Another vase that I picked up or a planter that looks like a vase to me is this. I think this is gorgeous. I love the black texture that it has on it. It really looks high end to me. And again, I think this was just a little over $5. And with a faux greenery piece inside just kind of draping over the side I think would look absolutely gorgeous styled just anywhere on any open shelves or on a tablescape for that matter. I know online I'm seeing lots of people running out trying to find this but our store actually had like I think four or five still in stock so I was real happy to be able to snatch that up and I like how again it has that drainage um, thing in the in the bottom and then it also has the pads to protect your surfaces so just take a look at all that texture there and again it just really to me looks very high end and again only five dollars and the last item that i picked up from walmart which is in the different section is kind of where they have all of their flowers faux flowers um, it is this wood chip basket. I think it was just under $11 as well, but to me, it reminded me of a tobacco basket. So I was like, oh my goodness, I have to have that. I love this as a layering piece behind other decor. I think that's really important when you're decorating is to just add different layers to just create a more interesting look. And just alone, I think this is gorgeous because of all the different lines and the texture that it gives, the warmth of the color. So I'm excited to use this. You could even set a picture in, fr in front of it or a mini wreath. So lots of ideas really you could use. You could even display it long ways and maybe even put it on your door kind of in place of a wreath and maybe put a welcome sign on it. And so again, lots of different ways to maybe use this. And for under $11, I think it's a great find from Walmart. And now what you've all been waiting for, here is your sneak peek of the bedding. So I ordered this online and went in store to pick it up. And it is the Casa Luna Linen Blend quilt and I love that it does have just a simple square detail. It is so soft and I think it's just something that I'm going to have for years to come. I love that it is neutral and I can pair different colored pillows to just change up the bedding from season to season. So here is a closer look at just the texture that it has. Again, I love it. I love the Casaluna line. You'll have to let me know if you also 
love and enjoy the Casa Luna line at Target. And so the last item I'll be sharing with you today also is in with the bedding and it is this very large oblong pillow that will go in between and in front of all the other pillows for our bedding. But this is kind of where I'm headed. I'm loving just this sage green along with this brown flower. I thought that was gorgeous. And if you remember, there was a lot of this type flower that was also at Walmart in the My Texas like tea towels. So I was like, wait, I've seen that somewhere right here. So isn't that kind of cool that both like the um, Target, I think this is, this is Threshold, this is Studio McGee. So the Studio McGee line and My Texas House have that same flower pattern. So I thought that was kind of neat. But I love the, just the little tassels and the color that that can bring in. I can match this with either the teal or even the brown. And of course this will look really great with the color of the bedding as well. So I hope that you enjoyed just seeing and coming along with me as we shopped Walmart and then just seeing the sneak peek of what's to come for our master bedroom. Now you know how I love to share with you a daily Bible verse. So go ahead, grab your Bibles and meet me over at the desk and we will read God's word. All right, so today we'll be reading from Isaiah chapter 12, verses five and six. Sing to the Lord, for he has done glorious things. Let this be known to all the world. Shout aloud and sing for joy, people of Zion. For great is the Holy One of Israel among you. I hope you did enjoy today's video. Definitely let me know in the comments what was your favorite item that I picked up. And if you're looking forward to seeing our mini makeover of our bedroom. I hope you have a fabulous rest of your day. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I would love to have you back. Well, have a great day and I will see you in my next one. Take care and God bless. Bye friends.